So hi and welcome to this presentation called Discover ASEA. My name is Christina Williams and it is such a pleasure to be with you tonight. I know there's a number of different reasons why you get invited to something like this and um, they may vary. You may be here because you're struggling with a health condition and somebody said, have you heard of redox signaling? It's something that maybe can help. You might be here because you are into preventative health, you've got a family, you want to make sure everybody stays nice and well and healthy. So you are excited about being able to uh, find out about this technology and what it can do for you. Um, you might be here because you are an athlete, you are into your body's performance, you, you want to get the most out of your, um, your training and fitness so you might be here just to find out what this technology can do for you as an athlete you might also be here because you are an entrepreneur and you are in the world of business and you're looking at new products you're looking at the latest and greatest advancements and this could be just a wonderful technology that you could participate in bringing into the world so for regardless of why you're here i'm going to cover uh, and explain what is the redox breakthrough? What is a SEER? And especially, how can you participate? Whether it is just as a consumer, whether it is for a health benefit, or maybe commercially, you want to play a role. Okay, so let's do this. Okay, so tonight, as I said, the title of the presentation is called Discover a SEER. And it is a breakthrough and I want to really be able to impart that on you that this is something completely groundbreaking, completely new. If you've not heard about it, I'm so excited for you this evening that this could potentially change your life as it has the lives of so many people around the world. So let's have a look at what exactly it is. It's a cell signaling supplement. A SEA Redox is 10 to 15 years ahead of its time. It's a product that is heavily patented and unique. So I was just on the phone actually to a nutritionist in Spain just before I got on this call. And um, one of the questions I always get is, you know, is it a vitamin? Is it a mineral? And always my response to people that are really uh, in the know is you've never seen this before. So it's a completely new category of science. The people that first understood what redox does for the body were given a Nobel Prize for medicine and physiology. And most exciting of all, it is body native, has zero toxicity and is incredibly powerful because it's already in your body and your body knows what to do with it. So firstly, I guess I'd like to give you a little bit of my background. You might be thinking, you know, how, how does she uh, come about, um, you know, telling us about this technology? No, I am not a doctor. Um, I did study health science. I studied physiotherapy. And then I took, as life does sometimes, a big diversion into uh, a completely different field. I had my children, I started working from home in marketing and digital advertising, and I was just kind of going along my life when this technology came into my world through this man called Dan Doyle. And Danny, unfortunately, as you can see here, was diagnosed with a life-threatening condition, and um, we watched his fight for life, and after two years of really struggling, um, and really just following everything that he was told to do, all the chemical treatments he was put through. Uh, I mean, really, he went to hell and back. Doctors told him, we can't save you. And that was, um, I believe it was October 2014. And it was really wonderful because a friend of ours rung him in that moment and said, Dan, have you heard of redox signaling? And if it wasn't for that phone call, I hate to think where Danny would be today. Um, but Cod, I don't know if you're on the call, but I, I always think about the, the wonderful, um, you know, the way you changed Dan's life and so many thousands of lives around the world just through that one phone call. And that's really all we do is we share the information about this technology. It's what we're doing tonight. And that one phone call led to Danny getting on a plane, going to the States, understanding what Redox was using it for his recovery and really then now becoming somebody who is a massive ambassador for this product and this technology around the world, helping thousands of people. We're not saying that this product cured him. This product isn't a cure for anything. What you'll see in a moment is that technology inside these two products activates your own body's potential to repair itself. 
And that is why Danny is here today. And so are thousands and thousands of other people around the world who are experiencing the power of redox. So when I saw my friend Danny go through this recovery, uh, I mean, you, you can imagine I was just so personally impacted by this because imagine if it's you and you watch one of your best friends get such incredible results. What's the next thing you're going to want to do? Naturally, you're going to want to share this with other people. And so that's exactly what Danny did. He started, um, uh, we started talking to other people through Danny, through Malcolm, through some of our other friends, because we knew that more people needed to hear about this. And although redox biochemistry can be a little bit complex, I really want to just simplify it down to five easy points that will help you understand it. But before I give you those five easy points that explain what redox molecules are exactly, let's clean the slate of anything else, as I mentioned, that we think it might be. It's definitely not a vitamin, not a mineral, not an antioxidant, not an exotic juice, not an alkaline water. Do you need all these in your body? Yes, absolutely. As I, as I said in the conversation with this nutritionist, we need these just as much as we need bricks and cement and, um, and wood and wire to build a house. But you can't do much with materials if you don't also have the workforce that shows up to use those materials. And uh, she's looking at this technology because she knows there's a lot of people that, are, that have all the nutrition, that take incredible supplements, but their cells are tired and they're broken and they can't even use those incredible materials. So redox is really the other side of the equation to complete cellular health. Here are my five points to describe it exactly. Firstly, we are made of cells. You and I are big bags of cells. They are hair cells, skin cells, lung cells, you know, liver cells, brain cells. They're all cells. And all cells are constantly doing a few, uh, well, quite a few jobs throughout the day, constantly protecting, repairing. And in the case where some cells become dangerous, there is a process of destruction and replacement. The cell literally tags itself for destruction and makes a healthy new one. This is when the body's working well. And we already knew that this was happening. Uh, you already know it's happening. I mean, you look at one of your kids when they fall over on their bike and their skin just weaves back and repairs itself. It's actually incredible if you think about it. We are constantly repairing. We knew that was happening. What we didn't know was how. And of course, this is a really important question because it is the, the, the pathway to unlocking the whole reason why we age, to unlocking the reason why we heal and being able to harness our body's own processes. And so in 1998, these three gentlemen were given the Nobel Prize for Medicine and Physiology because they were the first to truly identify what the redox signaling molecules did in the body. In fact, it's a little bit incorrect what I've written there. It wasn't uh, the first signaling molecule was discovered, not at all. We knew they were there, we just didn't know what they did. And these guys identified it. And what they said is, these molecules are the actual trigger behind all those processes that we mentioned before going on inside the cell. So just like, um, just like anything inside the cell, it's all it is is a chemical reaction. Every time it produces a protein, every time it fixes a, a cell wall, every time it fights bacteria, if you really boil it down, these are just chemical reactions taking place and chemical reactions require a trigger. Now, as we age, we make less and less and less of these triggers and this is why we age. So that mitochondria, the little powerhouses inside our cells, which are the factories producing these redox molecules, they slow down, they become sluggish, and you and I, again, even though science has proven it, you and I already know this. We know that things slow down at around the age of 40. You know, uh, I mean, I'm 40 this year, and I know there's a difference when I go out for a run um, and the way that my knees kind of hurt, the way I wake up the next day, it's very different than when I used to exercise in my 20s. And of course, in 20 years time, our bodies continue to even slow down more and more. So these deficiencies are the natural part of aging, 
but they are being accelerated and aggravated by the toxicity in the environment. This is really uh, unavoidable. And I know some of you are saying, yes, but I eat really well and also I um, you know, avoid eating out and I don't smoke, Christina, I hardly drink. That's all good, but I'm sorry, unless you literally live in a sterile bubble, you are breathing things, you are touching things, you don't really know what the hairdresser's using on your hair, you don't really know what's in that pizza you had at the restaurant, um, we are exposed to so much toxicity and not just um, chemical toxicity, but stress toxicity, the toxicity we create inside and the external toxicity. And the result of that, I mean, again, this is not something you don't already know. People are getting sicker and sicker and aging has become synonymous with becoming ill and it shouldn't be that way. We just all... Um, we just all assume someone is going to get something in our family. It's really, really sad, but there's hardly any family I know that hasn't been touched by cancer or that somebody hasn't, hasn't got a child on the spectrum or that somebody hasn't got a heart disease. It really is scary. And I know right now we're heavily focused on, on COVID, but it's not the only health crisis we have on our hands. And, um, you know, what's incredible to me right now is that we can do so much about all these numbers here because it wasn't always this way. This is not inevitable. 50 years ago or well, 100 years ago, we weren't dying of these diseases in the numbers that we are today. Why have these numbers increased? Because our environment and our lifestyles have become much more toxic and we haven't done anything to improve our body's ability to deal with it. And that's why I get excited about ASEA because it is a breakthrough that allows us to tackle this because there's really only two ways around it. You can go and live on Mars and live in an absolute sterile bubble and not partake in the world and then kind of free yourself from stress and toxicity. Or you can find a way to increase your body's tolerance and ability to deal with the world we're actually in. So that's what ASEA has done after I think it was 17 years of, of research and trial and error, they managed to do what many said would be impossible, and that was to stabilize redox signaling molecules inside a product that is consumable and non-reactive. So this is incredible. It's like catching a spark of fire and bottling it. Um, when I talk to people who understand redox biochemistry, they cannot believe this has been achieved. But what it does is it allows you and I to finally get to the root cause of the problems and be able to um, address our health issues in a really direct way. A lot of the time, we just keep, uh, we get given tablets and pills and potions and lotions that don't actually fix the problem. All they do is they mask the symptoms. And that can be okay for a while. I, I'm glad there's some of the um, medicines out there that we have access to. I'm glad for that temporary relief, but I am not going to be in denial that they're going to heal me. They're not designed to heal me. Healing needs to happen at the root of the problem. You can't put out a fire <laughs> far away from the fire. You need to get close to it. You need to get on top of it. And that's what cellular health is all about. Going to where the fire is and repairing the body from the inside out. So here we have a technology that finally allows us to do that. It has been validated scientifically. I'll go very quickly through the studies. If you want to dive in and look at them closely and slowly and read till your heart's content, you can. But I'm just going to breeze through it right here because not everybody, um, not everybody's that interested, to be honest. Most people just want to know, you know, what can it do for me? But it has been validated scientifically by an independent laboratory, which is called BioAgilitics. What they do is they prove that what you say is in the bottle and in that tube of gel really is in that tube of gel. We are FDA registered and NSF certified, which means the product is, is, is produced and manufactured to standards. It has got the compliance to be sold and distributed. It's not a pharmaceutical, so we don't need to go under that FDA approval. Because quite frankly, if your FDA, uh, if you require FDA approval, it's because your product can kill you, and that way the FDA has to register and and regulate how you use that product. 
So we're registered and we don't require the FBA approval. And uh, different countries have different regulations, but in any of the 34 markets where we distribute this product, be assured, we have gone through all the loopholes to make sure we can bring this to market um, under all the compliance requirements. The product has been given five stars for safety, which is great. And that's the reason why even Olympians use it and um, you know, babies, pregnant women, because it has zero toxicity. For people who um, are wondering, you know, is it just the ASEA company that's talking about Redox? Is Redox a buzzword that this company came up with? You know, is, it, is it a marketing tactic? I would invite you to dive into the world of Redox. Whilst you may not know about it, and maybe even your doctor may not be aware about it, be assured it is an absolute hothouse of activity when it comes to the scientific research. In the last few years, over 18,000 studies have been published in this field at exploring the potential of redox in neurodegenerative disease, diabetes, cancer, um, you know, inflammatory disorders. Now, I'm not making the leap. I never do this sort of thing. I don't make an automatic leap and say, therefore, our product can cure cancer. We're really not making any kind of statement like that. But what we are saying here is that redox within your body is, uh, is incredible, has the potential to keep you healthy, keep you strong, keep you young. And we're the only company that are able to produce it and help you increase those levels. So, of course, it's being used by people all around the world with a variety of different health concerns. And it's being used by people who are healthy who don't want to end up with those health concerns. So let's just have a quick look at everything that we know that we can prove this is doing in your body. We know that a SEER redox triggers genetic expression. So it activates, switches on the genes that are responsible for your immune system function, that help with your inflammatory response, that help with your cardiovascular health, that promote gut health and enzyme production, that restore hormonal balance, that help your cells talk to each other, reduces free radical and oxidation, activates antioxidants in your system by up to 500 to 800% in such a short time, kills viruses and bacteria that it's been tested against, improves athletic performance in an amazing number of ways, which includes endurance, recovery, VO2 max, circulation. It's burning fat fuels by up to 33%, and it's completely naked to the body and proven to have zero toxicity and supported by science. When I look at this list, you know, I couldn't think of a reason why I would not want these benefits in my family. I, I spend so much time with people who are sick, you know, really, really sick, fighting for their lives. And it breaks my heart and always reminds me, and I want to take a moment to remind you, if you're lucky to have your health right now, protect it. Protect it because otherwise you could end up as a statistic. And, it, and really, like, preventative health has always been, like, you know, it's just so optional I feel like these is, this is one of the most urgent, important things that we need to prioritize. How you look after your health really is going to determine how you age, you know, um, and, and where on which side of the statistics you end up on. So please consider um, these benefits, not just in the light of sickness, but in the light of prevention. Okay, moving right along, we have uh, explored a little bit about what the drink does. Obviously, that's going to be impacting healing from the inside out. Now, the gel is going to be making a big impact from the outside in. So I, I don't want to go through those numbers there. I'd rather show you in pictures. But in just 28 days, you can see some massive changes to the skin, to the body, um, and of course, it's really easy to see with the gel because it's quite visible. So whether you're looking at things like um, pigmentation, acne, wrinkles, whether it's skin condition um, or whether it's just aging, uh, what we're looking at right here in these images is proper, healthy, new cell regeneration. And who would not want that in their bodies? I get excited, of course, by these pictures on the surface, but I'm more excited thinking about these changes happening in my liver, in my lungs, in my digestive tract. 
Um, and really the gel, although we talk about it a lot for the face, it is an all over body product. Uh, you can see their capillaries, you can see stretch marks getting better. Of course, we see people's lives transformed when they've come to a CR because of a chronic skin condition. Um, we know from so many different testimonies, we have a Facebook page where there's literally thousands of people sharing their testimonies. And it's not just people. Um, people sh uh, talk about pets. We often see uh, the impact of redox on plants. Really, all biological matter is going to do better when it's in touch with redox. And then, of course, we move uh, and are moved to hear some incredible stories, which uh, I won't, you know, we won't read them right now, but I invite you to go into the Facebook page. If you're considering this um, uh, for yourself, uh, for usage, or even if you're considering it because you want to look at distribution, I invite you to go read the reviews. We have a Facebook page called the CR Healthy Self with thousands and thousands of reviews. If you're gonna to go to a restaurant, you don't just read one review, you don't just see what one person has said. You look at reviews and you don't look at reviews of people who can you know, judge the restaurant from across the street. You wanna hear from people that went there and sat at the table and ate there. What did they have to say? That's why I love that page filled with testimonials because these are not scientists, these are not theories. These are people who have had their lives transformed by this technology and I wanna hear from them. I do get excited by the studies, but at the end of the day, this is why I got involved. This is what makes it worth it, is lives being changed. You know, as I said, I was in the, in the world of marketing and advertising previous to this, and I didn't feel I was making a difference in anybody's life. I was frustrated. I, I had seen my friend Danny go through a complete transformation, and I thought, you know what, that would be so satisfying to be able to hear people's lives transformed uh, beyond my friend Danny. Who else can we help? And around the world, there are a number of different markets. We've mentioned already the beauty industry. We've mentioned already uh, health and wellness. And of course, there's the whole fitness, athletics, sporting, pro sports. We have Olympians. We have um, all kinds of different uh, athletes from around the world who use the product and love it. And just in case you're thinking, you know, are they getting paid money to endorse the product? I'll tell you right now, they're not. Uh, the way that ASEA chooses to sponsor their athletes is through product only. So right there on the bottom right-hand side, you have Dominique Easley. He plays for the LA Rams. Um, and uh, he had an incredible uh, recovery with this product on his uh, ACL. And, you know, they need them back on the field really, really quickly. And, he was just absolutely chuffed with what he got to experience with us here. And um, so he applied. We applied with him to become an ASEA athlete. And what's really exciting is that the offer to him um, wasn't about, you know, here, we'll pay you thousands of dollars to say this about us. It was like, please tell us what your experience is. Feel free to share your experience. Um, and we'll supply you with free products. So anytime you see athletes using ASEA, it's because they're doing it for the free product. That tells you something about why they want to endorse it. So, okay, so we've got to a point right now where I've, I've only got a few more minutes to go with this presentation, but this is really important because one of the questions you might be wondering is, why is it, why is Christina telling me this? How come my doctor doesn't know about it? And, you know, uh, and, and how come this isn't just sitting on a shelf at Coles? Well, let me tell you why. Because those avenues simply would not be effective. Would you buy something from Coles that is in a blue bottle called Redox and you don't even know what Redox is? Of course not. Would you uh, distribute a non-pharmaceutical product through the pharmaceutical avenue? Well, it doesn't make any sense. Uh, the pharmaceutical avenue, by the way, they did want this product. They made a significant offer to our company for the rights to this product but it was not for distribution. It was for suppression. They wanted clinical trials gone. They wanted everything to go away. And there was a lot of uncertainty if they ever planned to release this. And so a, a, a brave, a very brave and strategic decision was made to go and take this product through the world, to the world 
through the avenue, the channel that is most effective and that is word of mouth. I said I came from advertising and you cannot beat a word of mouth recommendation. Uh, I mean, think about it. Uh, I've seen uh, so many trailers for a particular movie. I haven't watched it. It was only the other night when my sister said, Christina, you should watch it. You're going to love it. It's such a good movie that I finally decided to put it on. Um, you can drive past a restaurant a million times, but when your friend at work says, have you tried such and such as, and then you think, oh, really? Well, maybe we should. Nothing beats word of mouth. And for a product that is as effective as ours, word of mouth is going to trump. You cannot distribute a lousy product through word of mouth, by the way, because your reputation just would be unsustainable. If you were waiting for people to share their testimonies and nobody had a testimony, this wouldn't go very far. But in the case of ASEA, we knew that this product was absolutely groundbreaking. And so it made absolutely sense because the product can be shared easily by users. And guess what? There is, no, there is not a single existing competitor in the marketplace, in or outside of direct sales. Nobody else in the world is making this product. So it made a lot of sense to just basically have the monopoly on Redox. I mean, I hope other people start to, to, to invest into this field because it'll make us all advance faster. But right now, this is the only place where this breakthrough can be accessed. So if you are looking at distribution, I hope that kind of like pricks your antenna up because there are not many opportunities to have such positioning with any kind of product in the world. 34 markets, completely exclusive rights, and entirely a business that you can drive, a distribution model that you can operate from your home. And that's what I started to do. I did not wake up one morning and decide I wanted to, to, to have a business with a CR. I didn't. Really, it was, for me, quite an organic process. I saw my friend get better. I told other people about the product. I started to see their results. I became excited and passionate about getting more people to see those similar results. Next thing, I was finding it so much more satisfying to share this incredible product with other people rather than uh, keep slogging away at my old work, which was not satisfying, not giving me the results I wanted and not allowing me to make an impact. So the company is now 10 years old. They're doing uh, around 160 million in yearly sales turnover, although we are growing very, very quickly. So you can see those figures uh, will drastically change for this year already. We've had a very strong first quarter. And they are forecast with current growth predictions to hit the billion dollar turnover in the next three to five years. Now that might not interest you if you're looking at this just as a consumer, except a company that's growing that quickly on just two products tells you those two products are really good. And as a consumer, that should give you some comfort and that should help you understand that what we have here is truly something that people are seeing benefits from or it wouldn't be growing at this pace. And if you're looking at this from a distributor point of view, if you're looking at this commercially, you want to catch a wave like this in your life. I mean, there's so many things that I wish I had been part of. I wish I had uh, invented Facebook. I wish I had uh, come up with the idea for Uber. These are massive market shifts. And yet the fastest growing industry right now is the health industry and all around the world, the uh, uh, people are poised and open and ready for innovation. People are looking for better products. People are looking for better ways to get the results in their health that they're desiring. And we have a groundbreaking technology right here to bring to others and make an impact. So as I mentioned, the health industry is at an incredible fast growing rate. Right now, I know there's a lot of people suffering economically around the world, but I tell you the health industry is not suffering. And unfortunately, because of the way that we are um, a very, you know, very sick society, there is so much in the way of growth and opportunity to make a difference in the health industry. And if you've never come across a direct sales or network marketing or distribute or, or direct distribution um, opportunity, um, let me tell you this. I wasn't particularly chuffed to go down into this path, except it made sense. Once I understood that I couldn't buy this off the shelf, I certainly wouldn't, that this would not come through the pharmaceutical avenue, I understood why they chose this model. And also, when I looked and explored objectively the direct sales industry, I realized it's just like any business. Today, I spoke to somebody who's developing a website to distribute 
dive products. You know, there's people who distribute shoes online. There's people who distribute um, um, financial products online. It really is just like any business. We're an online distribution biomedical company that you can drive from your home and get me to the pie. The, the industry is growing really, really fast and it is the highest paying career in the world, second only to professional sports. I'm not gifted in the, in the area of professional sports. I certainly didn't have any money to invest into a business. I didn't have the time to spend two years developing a business before it was profitable. For me, it was a really good fit. As I said, it was a really good fit because there was nothing on the market like it and I could get involved at a very important moment in time when Redox hits the world. So in summary, these are the reasons I got started. And maybe some of these reasons could resonate with you. You may start off as a consumer. Eventually, you'll probably think of people that need to hear about this also. And you might upgrade yourself to an associate and participate with the distribution. Or the penny may have dropped already and you're thinking, wow, if this is really what they're saying it is, then I want to play a part in bringing this to more people. It's a breakthrough science with zero competitor, no risk. You don't need to invest into this. You just need to get busy sharing it with other people. And it's good and really simple to share with other people because we're not looking for a minority. Everybody has cells. Everybody could benefit from better health, from feeling stronger, from looking younger. This isn't like a kind of weird gadget that, you know, that is maybe a tiny percentage of the population might want uh, as a little luxury product. This is something that is essential and is able to be in every single home around the world. So our market is massive and it's a very simple product range. That excited me because, I mean, I'm a mum. I was running a company. I didn't have the chance to completely retrain myself and learn about 500 different nutritional products. These are two products, one technology. It's a strong comp plan. The right moment in the market that is significant. I know that this will always be a good opportunity, but right now it's better. <laughs> right now is a really good time. The way we're growing is, is really exciting. Maybe in five years, maybe in 10 years, uh, we won't have that kind of rate um, of growth. So, um, you know, personally, I, I think this is an in incredible moment in time to be part of this um, uh, company. But it's also been 10 years in the making of this moment. So it's not an experiment. You don't want to get involved with a startup. I've been involved with startups and a lot of them never got started. It is really, really scary. I don't know about you, but I didn't have the time to spend and the money to waste to see if something might work. What I loved about ASEA is that I looked around and I could see lots of people already doing really, really well, both with their health and with, their, um, with the compensation plan. The opportunity was strong and I could see those results transparently. I just had to decide if I had a reason to get involved. And that's the question I want to leave you with tonight. These are all maybe, you know, hopefully a little bit interesting facts that we've covered tonight. It's a really interesting breakthrough. The opportunity is really compelling, but it really doesn't matter unless it means something to you. Do you have something you want to accomplish, either with your health or your finances, that currently you don't have a way forward? For me, I had a very clear reason why I wanted to engage with this company. My family matters to me, their health matters to me, but also I wanted to give my family a better life than the one we had. And this is my husband and our six kids. We live across uh, two countries, America and also Australia. And our life would not be possible if it wasn't for the ability to work remotely, to have the freedom to move between both countries. Uh, I don't need to tell you six kids are expensive. You want to go on a holiday, you want to put them through private school. I did not want my life to be limited by money. And uh, people say money's not important. It really isn't. It's just numbers. But it gives you choices. I'm not obsessed about making a certain figure, but I am obsessed about making memories. I'm obsessed about giving my sons and for me and my husband to have the life that we want to have. It's not a dress rehearsal. You know, I had so many dreams. I had so many goals that had been stuck on my fridge for a really long time. And what a seer was for me was a vehicle where I could do something good for other people and at the same time, change my life and impact my family's future and give us better options. So whatever your engagement point is, I want to encourage you to have a little chat with the person who sent you this presentation 
or who, who's invited you along tonight and identify yourself as where, what the next step is, right? It really doesn't matter to us. We want to work with the people that want to work with us. There's enough people lining up to use the product. You're really not going to make or break this company. So it really is just about what you want to do next. Do you think that uh, you want to try the product? Um, my, my usual suggestion to people is if, you, if you're not sure about something, try it. You know, what have you got to lose? We're talking about your health. What if it worked? What if what we're saying is true? What if you could be one of these awesome testimonies in a few months time, you could have a compelling health story? Because if you don't do something about your health, it usually is going to just keep getting worse. You know, so um, I, I encourage you to be proactive and, and, and reach forward and say, okay, I'm going to look into it. I can see the studies. I can see people getting excited about this. I can see the testimonies. Am I worth it? Can I take a chance? That would be my first invitation for you. Discover the product for yourself. Don't take my word for it. Go and experience it in your home. Give yourself a three-month window to say, I'm going to see how my body goes on redox. How does my body perform when it's got the right tools? Number two, you might think, you know what? It's not just about me. I immediately know people that need to hear about this. I immediately can think of people who, who would value their fitness, uh, improvements on their fitness, who have health concerns. I immediately know people who might want to look at the compensation plan because they're looking for income streams. So you might have a small circle of, uh, of influence that you immediately want to connect us with. And there's people who will support you and come and explain this on your behalf. And uh, so you might think, you know what, even if it just covers my own product usage, even if it just is an extra $500 a month that I can put towards a holiday once a year. Or finally, you might be, as I said, the penny may have dropped for you really early. I, I was a bit slower, but some people, the penny drops. You might recognize this for what it is, a once in a lifetime monster of an opportunity. And you might want to engage big time and you might want to go forward and build a big global empire or at least build a really big business and give yourself and your family better options and along the way impact a lot of lives. So I hope that you find the right category that fits you for the next step. And if, the, if none of those categories are a fit, I uh, thank you for coming along tonight anyway. Um, but you probably know people in your circle who, who would like to hear about this. So make sure that you come back if you need to explore this further, reach out for links, get the information that you need to make a wise decision and make an informed decision, not an emotional one, make an informed decision. So whatever you decide to go from here, you can sleep well at night and know it was the right choice. So thanks guys for having me tonight. I'm going to pause the recording. And if you, let's see if it was recording, it's not recording. If you'd like to stick around for some questions, I'd love to, to answer them for a few minutes. And if not, I wish you a really good night.